run. You know, our D line, our D line is very determined to get in the backfield this week. Uh, just you got to just, just play our game, get off blocks, and keep him inside the uh, the pocket so he, so, he, so, so so he don't get out of the pocket and make and try to make throws downfield and stuff. Do you guys like Thursday night games? I mean, is is it different than Saturday at all, or just? I think it's yeah. my first Thursday night game. Yeah. I'm, I don't know if I forget it last year or not. Last year. Be, 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 okay, so it's my second. So it, it's different because yeah. the weeks all backed up and practice, we, have, we have practice with, like this weekend, so it's very backed up and very different. But I don't look at it. I kind of just want to play football all, all the time, so I'm kind of just very focused on this game. Mentally and physically, though, having that couple extra days mm -hmm. in there between Oklahoma and, and Baylor coming up, how much do you do you enjoy that, or would you rather just get on with it and play? Um, it's a side of me I want to rest and recover, yeah. but other sides want to just keep going, just not nonstop football. But you know, sometimes you, your body needs that because if you just keep banging, banging for a long time, your body wears down and gets tired, gets hurt. So I feel like these weeks off that we had was very important. You feeling a little better? Yeah, for sure. Just wearing tear time. Yeah, for sure. Coach Brown's mentioned that reset theme, and yeah. you know, for this final half of the season, what do you do personally to reset um, or out of the, outside of this building? Just relax. I kind of I don't really do much. I kind of get my mind off like everything. Just relax and uh, just watch a favorite movie or just watch a football movie or watch games, games like NFL games, just to learn off them. I kind of just like keep my mind off things. You know, just relax. When you're watching games, you watching as a fan or are you watching D line? No line. Both. I mean. It depends what team. If it's like the Ravens or Chiefs, I kind of watch as a fan. But also at the same time, I kind of watch to see what they're doing that, that I can do to like help my game out. Because they're obviously in the pros for a reason. They, they make money doing stuff that are like perfection. So I kind of just like watch you know, their D-tackle, D-lines overall to see how they work their hands and like how they attack all the lines. So. Is there one play you like to model your game after that plays in the NFL? or? I do like J.J. Watt, I mean, because he's kind of like, he's obviously not the same way. I'm like heavier, but like size-wise, he's, he's, I'm like I'm like right up there with his height. You know, I, I watched his his, his um, career highlight not too long ago, and uh, I, I went just like that, like that, that um, the power, the speed, and, you know, right now I kind of just, I, it's kind of hard to model yourself, but him is kind of like that, that dude. I want to do it, so. Seems like one of his big attributes, though, is just going every play, oh, going yeah, hard, sure. even when he's not. Is yeah, that? For sure. does, did that catch your eye about him? Oh, for sure. I mean, like, cause like, like he's very like interjected by games, very positive. So like, that's one thing that, that like caught my eye. He like, he, he like he's he's he attacks to do every play, wears him out. So I, I'd start like wearing people out and start getting to QB and stuff like that. So.